and welcome to my channel. I am Yoshida and this is Norris Cove. Today I just did a video on my Simply Gilded box, The Enchanted Forest. I did a um, pretty much what's in my box. So now I love the kit so I didn't have to make a kit this week. So we're jumping into my B6 and we're going to do our spread with that nice kit. Let me show you guys the kit because the haul video probably won't come out until afterwards. So you have these pretty bows. We have this sheet here, and it has important to do today, um, to pay. We got some nice flags going on here. We have some little, mini little things here. And we also have um, some nice boxes. And I think the thing, well, the theme is Enchanted. And then we have moths, and then we have our day headers, and then some flag boxes, some other little small circles things, circle things here. And, uh, well, we're not, we don't need a German card. Right? And then we also have this little box here. So I'm going to lay my dates. Let's go right in. This is how last week ended up looking like. Um, and this is the kit that I made. So we're on Friday, so I haven't filled anything over here. But in this section, I tell you guys, normally I fill this in later of things that come to mind I need to do. I'm setting up a decluttering section. I'm trying to declutter. So this is what it is. So this is things I've had to make a list of for the house and for my spiritual mind. I have a list over here. And then anything else extra was going there. So this is this week and it looks like i had some bleed through so we'll definitely have to um find a way to cover that up so yeah i'm gonna lay these boxes the date uh covers and then i'll be back okay you guys so i decided to do a voiceover and here i'm laying down my washi tape that i got in the simply gilded uh, kit. So I realized it was kind of thin, so I needed to white out some of the lines at the bottom so that you couldn't see them. You guys, I'm trying something different. <laughs> at least I was trying to. Um, I recorded this with my phone, but I wasn't quite sure how to do it. So you may seem like the um, video is moving. It's not. I was trying to pan out the fact that I didn't... Um, that I wasn't quite close in range and kind of bring you all a little closer. Um, but yeah, so right now I'm just laying the washi tape and then I decide, you know, let me go ahead and decorate this page that I never show you guys how I decorate because I'm loving this washi tape right here. I've got to use it again <laughs> and I think I may use it in my classic this week. So I was loving it so much. I wanted to bring it over to the other side and I decided that I would just use this page for memos. So I took that little moth to kind of cover up where I didn't reach over far enough with the tape. And I'm going to use this double box here on Monday and Tuesday because they were so pretty. And Monday and Tuesday seems to be a little light for me. So here I'm just laying a to-do sticker, a today sticker, and this flag um, sticker. And then it came to me like, okay, you have the smaller washi tape. So use that smaller washi tape. Break it up. Do something different. So it's so funny to me because now people are like, I kind of know your style of planning. And I knew that it was <laughs> your page. And I'm like, I really worked hard to try to, you know, switch it up a little bit. But I guess that washi is a dead giveaway. So, yeah, I use the washi as like um, header boxes to basically just kind of cover up. And blend and guess that box is crooked, but it's okay. We're just going to roll with it. So, because this tape does stick pretty good. So, I did try to lift it up and it was just like coming up. So, I was like, I'll just leave it. And I'll probably throw a moth or something up there to camouflage it. But I do love this kit. And I'm not a purple fan. I mean, it's pretty. But I like the lightest of the purple, which is more close to pink. So, but this kit right here, I am digging. I really, really like this kit. And as per usual, the quality of the paper is just like butter. It's so smooth. 
So if you guys have not checked out Simply Gilded's um, subscription box, just get one. I mean, well, you can. I think you can order one, but just get one to how many ever great pens come in it. The paper quality, you will be hooked. Okay, you will definitely be hooked. So here I'm just basically trying to figure out if I need to add some more or if I shouldn't or, you know, I didn't want to overdo it. But I still, as usual, want to make it functional for myself because I do come in here. I still come into my B6, but I like for it to be pretty, but again, functional. So again, I'm just basically looking to see how can I make it pretty? How can I just keep it functional for myself without overdoing it? Because I did fill up. I filled up my pages once and I said, I will never do that again. I couldn't come in and write anything. It was just pretty. That was it. So now I'm coming over to um, Saturday and Sunday. And I said, okay, let me try to get use of these flag boxes and make sure that I have everything functional. And I did pretty much the same thing and add my tape again as header boxes. But I'll let you all see how this comes out. I don't want to talk to you deaf. Just want you to enjoy the video. If you have any questions or comments, just leave them in the comment section below. Okay, you guys, so I'm back, and this is what we have. It is gorgeous. I love this kit. I think out of all the kits I've gotten from her, this is my favorite. I've only used one other, one kit I didn't use because I just did a lemonade theme from another one. Let me show you. Oh, it's, it's probably in an older, because this is a new insert. But, um, yeah, she just sent a lemonade one, and I didn't use that one because I just did a lemonade um, theme. But this is my favorite out of the three that I've received. I actually like the colors. I'm a pink and green type of girl, neutral. And these bright colors are so pretty to me. I don't know why something is just drawing me to them. And these moths, they're like... Like I said, I don't do moths, but these moths are so pretty. I tried to put them throughout without making it look too janky, you know. So this is it. This is what we have going on. So I decided to decorate this page with you guys just so that you can see um, kind of my thought process of what I do when I do when I am decorating this page so I'm in my mind I'm setting it up for the week and things I need to remember. So this week I didn't do a declutter because I put declutter pretty much in every spread and all my um planners so that's what we have here i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you would love to see more content from myself you would like to see more spreads like this anything else from me please hit that subscribe button also hit that notification bell so that you're notified when i upload content and i will see you in my next video bye